I don't really know this part of Dorset very well, but um, it's very incredibly beautiful. And um, on the way here to uh, Matravers, I passed an incredible um, wooden version of Stonehenge and uh, I thought it looked very good. Recently, a new henge has been built in southern England. Woodhenge is an impressive sculpture made from old tree trunks. Just to say that I think this is a wonderful, I was going to say erection, but it is, isn't it really? Because it's a, some wood that has been put together by our local publican, Charlie. And uh, it's a fantastic version of Stonehenge called Woodhenge and we think it's marvellous. Built on a whim by Charlie Newman, the landlord of the Square and Pumpus pub, the wooden circle didn't take long to attract the attention of local planning officers. I know they built it without sort of permission. No, I think it's absolutely lovely. It's the first time I've seen it. Um, I'm a photographer myself and I'll be back to take photos of it and I do think it's really special. Built without planning permission, Local government officials have ordered the removal of the structure by the 4th of September. I think it's very special to have something like this built and the fact that they're recycling um, pieces of wood that they've just chopped down and made such a special monument to the Perbic, um, Perbic State. Tell them it's a sculpture, a sustainable piece of eco-art. It looks better than most of the stuff the council's put up. I think it's excellent. Uh, it's a brilliant idea um, from some waste trees. And, and when, you, when you look at it, it, with the background as well, that makes it all the more uh, better. And I think the council are just a little short-sighted in asking for it to come down. I think it's brilliant. Charlie is reported as saying, the opportunity to build this presented itself after I took down a 25-foot tree. Oh, I think I, I really like it. It's nice and natural looking and lovely views around here. So I see nothing wrong with it at all. Good on you, Charlie. The square and compass stays awesome. Yes, I don't see anything that I don't like about it. Campaigners have started a petition to save the Henge. I'll bet the builders of Stonehenge didn't get planning permission and theirs stayed up. I wanted Charlie to have the final say, but he was too busy cutting wood to comment. Will the Henge be allowed to stay? Somehow I doubt it.